Alright, so welcome back. Today's video, I'm going to be painting the calipers and drum cover today. Quick swing by O'Reilly's to grab some stuff I need for my cousin. Let's look at this. Look how the car sit, bro. It's just so mint. Can't even hate the fit, man. I'm painting these drums. Uh, the color I'm going is lime green, like this valve valve cover. I'm going to be sanding this down and primering it and painting it. When I go home, y'all see. Yeah, the calipers going to match as well. Paint those calipers. I'm going to clean them off and paint them. The fitment on these wheels is crazy, like how the clearance between here. I'm hearing some noise still from this wheel over here. I'm gonna have to really check it out and see what it is. And I'm just got my hand in there trying to check out the, if I feel any movement in between the obvious heart run. It's no movement. It's stiff as hell. This is just sitting pretty, literally. Get everything all set up, get it, everything dialed in a bit, right? To be painted, feel me? It's gonna look 10x better, it's gonna be more eye catching because right now it looks good don't get me wrong it do look good but imagine if it I had to paint it like it turns into a puzzle like this everybody like somebody's gonna be you know like looking at it like damn that shit clear yeah. hopefully that's what it's going home and go get everything set up get it dealt with you feel me and to car just looks so good sitting pretty bro it's crazy calipers i'm gonna clean those up and get everything painted so it's gonna be even more clean like i love how this car came out bro and then when I, from that first video when i'm gonna post it to now the car is completely just transformed just the wheels alone just by putting the wheels on it and rolling it like it looks 10x better bro. I, I can't even i still can't believe it's still my car bro. like the car looks so much better and the crazy part about this i had these wheels for damn near two years sitting i'm like I, i'm gonna start a youtube video and start documenting everything i do to the car i put off all that like wrist Driving with bad tires, all that, bro. Look how sitting pretty the car is, bro. I'm almost home. You got to get the car set up on Jackson. Imagine if I had somebody take rollers, bro. Okay, was, seeing what the car is looking on on the outside. It's on jack stands, I got the wheels off. I'm gonna be cleaning off these calipers. And I'm gonna be masking them down. These drums right here is getting changed today. I'm gonna leave the drum right now on the car. I'm gonna just go get my drill, put in the drill bit that has the wire wheel, and just clean off all that rust. And then I'm gonna go back over it using my, my sander. I just sand the edges of it with like a 60 grit. Depends how much the, the rust, depends how much the takeoff. Depends if I start with 60 or 8. Same thing for this side. Come around here, do the same thing for this side. Same thing here, clean it off. And I'm gonna just use uh, the greaser and alcohol and everything clean. Nice, nice paint the brakes, calipers, and drums, drum covers. It's giddy. Drum covers are already starting to cook. Look, A1. All right, guys, so I got everything set up. I'm gonna be cleaning off this drum cover. Make sure I got my safety precautions. I'm inhaling the, the rust. Cyber freight drill isn't too bad. It's not spinning fast. I wish it was spinning fast. Way better than before, boy. I need this thing to be chrome, bro. Most of the hard parts already came off. That's just literally transforming. Oh shit. All right, update, I'm almost done basically. The side came out mint. I knew in the last clip the camera angle was gonna be blocked off. I didn't realize. Basically, I'm just wiping out everything with alcohol right now. Seeing how everything coming out. Y'all see how transformed the drum is. The drum cover is now, so yeah. Just to get the other side done and then I'm gonna take it off and hand sand it. To try to get all the grimes and cruds off and crap. So yeah. Go ahead and pull it back to handbrake so it doesn't spin as much. Right, hand brakes pulled. Go ahead and mask on this. Get off all the remaining crud that I didn't get off. You wipe it off now. Sheesh. The rest I'm gonna have to sand out. Wet sand. I'm gonna have to sand it. Yeah, that's what you get it, boy, but all that surface rust is gone. Look at that shit, boy. Let me see if I can get this kind of sanding off the pub. Look at that. Look at the difference, bro. Well, the rest I'm going to have to get sanded off, but look at that. This. Yacht! <laughs> Same thing on this side. Let me go ahead. Get set up. I 
one eternity later. So the drill died on me like two times. So now I'm about to just switch over to Big Bertha. Uh, I'm about to just, that right now is a 60 grid. Get these sanded down. The next day. So, update. I got everything cleaned off yesterday. I'm still gonna go over it because it is some, like some rust on it, just a little bit. It doesn't seem like it is none now. I'm just gonna go over it using my drill, make sure everything come out like how I want it. Same thing on this side. You can see the difference. It's literally night and day. Like, sheesh. And we're gonna be painting it soon. I just started at the crack of dawn right now. It's like nine o'clock. Get everything finished, fully dialed in. Sander and get everything smoothed out. I know it's smooth right now. But I'm gonna see, it's like some- Get stuff. ready to get ready to paint it. Same as the front calipers, I did clean these off. Those are mad clean. I'm gonna put a, like a high grid on it. I got like 320, I'm gonna put a little bit of 320 grid on it. So it's like the paint stick actually good on it. Same as this one, I cleaned it off. And yeah, uh, go back over it with these drill and then I use sandpaper. I got my water to wet sand it. Got my degrees here. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and continue with what I'm doing, my cleaning process. I'm trying to get everything cleaned off. And yeah. Mother, are you done? Basically. Oh, you're almost right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I want to talk foolishness again. So this side is basically pretty much cleaned off. It's like, it's pretty much cleaned off. I'm gonna just step around on this side and see if I clean some of the curd, curd off. Because it is some curd on this, it's probably not picking it up, I can't wait. I see a little bit of rust right there. All right, you guys, a quick little update. This is how far I got with the drum. I mean, they're pretty much clean, but I'm gonna just go over it then with Bertha. This freaking plane passing by is so goddamn loud, bro, but that's besides the point. One day we'll be owning a plane, one day. The sun's out today. My primary, I could put it in the sun, let it dry, and then go ahead, and then my clear coat. So it came out hella good, bro. All that surface was, was just years of rust on it. Surface rust is caused from rain, uh, all types of terrain, etc. One time this car was in uh, hail, I believe. Some like hail damage on the hood. Easy to see, but there is one hail damage right there. And others across the roof have hail damage. All right, guys, basically, I got everything set up. I got an 80 grit, got the 120 on top, and then that bottom one, the 220. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit everything. When I'm painting, I'm gonna mask off the whole hub because I don't want to paint the hub. That's what the wheel mounts onto. And I'm gonna just sand around here, basically. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that first, and then uh, go ahead with my sanding. Because here's already clean, I already cleaned the hub off. That's how I got everything mounted, basically, all my paints right there. I'm gonna sand it down so I could get everything to stick. And then I go ahead and use my primer. And after my primer, I use my paint. After my paint, you already know, seal it off with that show car finish, that gloss clear. I got everything masked up paint. Uh, the tape mask up on it. That's how I got it looking all around for both of them. It was covering the hub because I'm not gonna be painting the hub. I'm gonna be priming it. So same thing for both sides. And I use my razor to just cut the tape off so that's all right so for those who don't know i'm gonna give a base like overview of how i did everything when i went from uh, the 80 to the 120 now i'm at 220 to smooth everything out i mean it's pretty smooth the primer won't really the primer is going to help prevent the rust from forming in the future the surface just that was on his off so i'm not even too worried about it and i just wiped it off with some alcohol right, so basically with my drum setup and everything this is basically how i did it. i'm sounding different because i have a mask on right now so i'm not inhaling what's coming off the drum the material you have my sander turn it on with that that's basically how i did it to get it smooth now and now i'm gonna just clean it off basically and then i'm gonna get to prep the paint basically and i'm wearing eye protection as well just in case so nothing doesn't fly in my eye but that's not gonna be good Make sure you wear some form of safety protection. I know I'm sure they have shoes on, but I'm at home, so it's like that. The drum is basically smooth as hell. Like, 
for more when now i'm gonna just prime it basically the drum took the longest because how bad they were yeah i'm gonna go ahead and paint it wipe off the oil and all that it's drying off now it's pretty much clean like it's not no debris on it you don't want to have debris on what you're painting because that's going to be in the paint but i set it up right here in my paint booth all right guys so i got my primer here to paint my brake drum so i'm just shaking it up i'm just shaking it up right now to make sure everything is dialed in yeah, yeah i'm gonna go ahead and paint make sure i got my mask on make sure i don't breathe this pepper. few moments later uh, with that i'm basically done show what i was doing you gotta show it under so now i just take the drum put it in the sun to dry you're gonna wait for it to dry then put it paint it yeah. you're gonna do the same thing with the other one yep. okay and so my brother guy. is gonna get the other one and he and he's it. You guys could see me right here, which I'm the little bro and you're my big bro. All right, quick little update. This is how the prime came out. I had to go over it like a couple times off camera, but yeah. It's drying now. It's hot as hell outside, but it's dry. He's painted up, you feel me? <laughs> little bro, I'm gonna let him do the first coat and then I'm gonna do the second coat. Like little debris left on, I'm just brushing it off. I'll go ahead and let him do the first coat and then I go ahead and do the other two coats. Yeah. Alright, stand up. Alright, so I got my little bro. He's gonna go ahead with the green. Look, I'm gonna show you how to do it and then you're gonna do it, okay? Okay. When you're spraying the paint, you're gonna spray it like this. Hold it and you just go across like that. Understood? You spray it and you go across. You sweep it like this. Okay. Got it? Yes. Yeah. Okay, let's see you do it. <laughs> Alright, look, bro. I'll do it. I'll do it. Alright, he's trying. Alright, props to you for trying a little man. Let me finish it up because you already made the paint right here. Eventually. All right, guys, so basically one of the can ran out on me and the paint started going to <gasps> shit. Like, you see all these grains and everything? One of the can ran out on me. I had to go buy two more cans. A few moments later. As y'all can see, one's brighter than one. But I'm just live with it, whatever. I'm not a professional painter by any means. <laughs> it's just at-home backyard shit, as y'all can see. They, pretty, they look pretty much the same on camera, but this one's lighter than this one. When it, the can was finishing, it started making everything flaky, basically, so like... The paint just came out kind of rough. I'm gonna see how everything came out. So sheesh, bro, look at that color. Yeah. This color right here is gas. This one's a little bit darker. Left side or right side? I'm gonna put LRR. Y'all comment which one look better in the comments. Sheesh, but yeah. That's after a couple hours later, if my brother helping me. Well, he was trying to. He's six, guys, so. You know how kids be when they get excited. 35 more minutes, let it actually dry. And then I'm gonna see if I could just use my sandpaper, barely just rub over it. As I'm rubbing, you can see the stuff falling off. I got a little paintbrush right here to see if I could brush off some of the flakes. While this one I messed up on, like some of the paint started coming off on this one. It's a scratch right there. But yeah, I'm not a professional painter by any means. Pay for so, I'm I'm happy with it. I mean, it's better than before. So, and it gives the car a little character. So, I'm not even too worried about it. It's not the best paint job. Don't get me wrong, because it does have its flaws. But I could live with it. You feel me? The drum covers. It's not the calipers. So who cares? You feel me? But yeah, it does look good, good as hell. I like how it came out. Can, can't be too mad at it. Did it at home, outside. Decent. I'll live with it. Your boy done messed up. Those are small spots that would mess with it. Now I had to go pull out primer. I got primer over here out of paint. Oh my God, this size is a mess, bro. Whatever. Is that my like an unfortunate dog? Every time I choose to work on my car, do anything on my car outside, bro. Look. Freaking Florida, bro. Like, come on, it'd be so hot. These other drums came out. I'm gonna just go over them with some clear coat now. It is what it is, though. It'll stop. I'm painting my calipers today, rain or shine. But I'm painting my calipers for you. Update the rain calmed down. I was able to tape off what needed to be taped off. This is what I taped off. I can see the two guide pin bolts. 
better than that. I took a break, man. The rain stopped me. Yeah. <laughs> My neighbor right there, he's just saying if I took a break or not because he's been seeing me on here this morning. But yeah, all right, so I'm about to start with my primer, lay my base coat. I don't know if my primer is good enough, so I'm gonna just leave it. True about it. I secured the inside of here, like a bag behind there, whatever it's there, I could clean it off after. So yeah, I'm gonna just let this sit for a couple of minutes and then I'm gonna go ahead with my paint. It looks so much better already. The rain's about to come down again, though. Yeah, my good luck, right? Let me get my paint. Just wait for this to dry. Jesus Christ, and look over there. Jesus, bro. Florida's so goddamn bipolar. Bro. I wanted it to be dried by the sun, but ain't no sun out. I already started, so let's see how far I could get before this rain start again. Sheesh, bro. Look, I got a drum cover on. This shit looks so gas, bro. Let's see if I like this side or like that side. They're both dry, bro. While the damn rain's debating, I got that on. The rain coming out. The rain's literally here debating whether or not it should start or not. It's windy as hell. Hopefully it doesn't rain for too long. If it doesn't, I should be able to finish my calipers because the drums are already done. Those took the most time and the most amount of cans, but that shit's so gas for, oh my God, look at it. All right, guys, don't lie, I'm about to continue what I'm doing. I'm about to continue painting it. The rain's like holding up, so I'm, a, I'm taking advantage. It's so goddamn fire, bruh. And out tell me that's pressure, bruh. Sheesh. That shit's pressure, dog. It's pressure. I'm gonna go ahead and let it dry down, and then I'm gonna give it like one more coat, and I think that's it. So the rear and front's matching, but sheesh. In the middle of our friggin' rainstorm, <laughs> Florida man shit. Go back over it one more time. So I give it two coats, basically. I wanted to do three, but I'm fine with how it's looking. They consider that size already messed up. It's matching, bruh, so sheesh. While there's an actual rainstorm out, but I gotta do what I gotta do, bruh. Can't wait on the screen forever. I packed up for it just so in yeah, case. yeah, guys, I just took my chances with the rain. And look at that goddamn caliper, bruh. Sheesh. That thing's sex. Matching the drum cover back. Like, this one's kind of overdone, but I like how light it is. This one's just a bit plain. This one's a bit less, like, apparent, but. That should look like a goddamn highlighter, bro. So I still gotta do this one. I gotta cover just in case it start raining. It's about to, it's Florida. I don't know what the hell's going on today. A few moments later. There it goes, it started. My drum cover's on, my drum covers will be fine. If the rain wash it off, that's just some BS. I got a caliper painted, I gotta cover back up. But yeah. bro, look at this. There's a whole tropical storm outside. Look at this shit. From all that sun this morning, look at this. The weather is the most perfect weather on planet Earth. Like, look at this. Out of nowhere, literally. This time I choose to work on my vehicle. Let's see what it's looking like, guys. Jesus. Gotta love Florida, boy. Jesus. Alright, let's see. Door lock. Pop the bay open. Yeah! And my paints are off. Oh, shit. Ah, shit. <laughs> hey, yo. Alright, guys. What up? It's the next day right now. The Civic's looking sitting pretty. Did paint the calipers in the rain, so it kind of came out shit, but... I like it's it. been turning heads even more today. Like, I had about two or three people just break their neck trying to look at it, especially when I came in the parking lot. Yeah, the calipers came out decent. I'm gonna clear coat it. I mean, it's okay. It could have been better, but you know, my first time doing shit, so I'm all right with it. That's an update with a caliper that's painted. It's looked gas as hell. I'm gonna, yeah, go. I'm gonna just move off from here, get to a different spot, and go ahead and record the car. And you can do vacuum right now. I'm about to go get this bit vacuumed. And hopefully, I get it washed either today or tomorrow. Step out and walk around. Yeah. So. My Civic's prettier. I don't give a crap. I got painted calipers and drum coat. Yeah, that's how this side came out. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's how the calipers came out. Drum covers came out. I do need to spray right here. The tape stop right there, but I'm not too worried about it. I mean, it, it's kind of bothering me a little bit. Wait, I'm not Paint came out, guys. Basically, yeah, like it's so goddamn picture perfect, bro. What's next? Headlights, new bumper, starlights, clear door handle. That's pretty much what's next. I have a great time.